Yo, what up YouTube, it's Rain, the ma 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 mask. So yesterday I put up a video saying if you wanted to see the review, give me 20 likes. 20, I got 21, so I'm going for this now. So this is going to be a quick look. So I'm not, I'm not going to say that I am a, a Reebok expert. Far from it actually. Um, but anyway, let me give you a look at these. So these are the ventilator affiliates. A UK size 6. If you buy these, my advice would be to go a whole size down. One whole size down. Like, I'm not trying to have a man say, Raw, oh, you said this. Go a whole size down. Trust me. Now, what these are, are the Bape or Ape. Actually, again, I say I don't know too much about these brands and whatnot. I just like the trainer. You know me, there's a few things that I like in it. So camo is one. Camo on a trainer, I'm buying it. I don't care what brand it is. It could be high tech, it could be Puma, it could be and one. If it's got camo, I'm buying it. The second thing is if it's black with a gum sole, you know that I'm into that as well. But anyway, so these ventilators. Ventilators kind of made um, a comeback for me. Um, they're a very old trainer actually, but made a comeback for me when I saw, uh, what was it they brought out? I think it was the, was it End Clothing? Then Wolf Ones, which were pastels or whatever. Um, and then there were some other ones that came out and then they had the Kendricks, which I think I reviewed, and then these. So, Ape, buy a bathing ape. I'm not too sure about the brand. I've always just thought it's been too expensive for me, so I don't buy shit from them. Uh, and I'm not sure if Bape and Ape are the same thing. So I'm sure someone's gonna tell me and, and tell me and tell me what the difference is between the brands. And maybe I should have researched it, but hey ho, it's not in my knowledge bank, so I left it. Anyway, this is their take on, or this is their collaboration with Reebok. So, getting into some of the detail. Actually, let me just hold on there, one second. Wallan! Let there be light. So, firstly, as you can see, the trainer has three M um, accents. So you can see them there, a little tiny bit there, boom, boom, boom. And then on the inside, you've got three M, um, obviously, as well. Um, kind of sets the trainer alight for me. Like when you're bopping down the road and rear, tear, 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 and you see three M, um, it's a mad thing. Oh, and for those that know me, another thing that gets me is three M um, and glow in the dark souls. My God. Whoever invented glow in the dark souls needs a Nobel Prize for something. Anyway, um, again, the 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 3M really really pops and it's a good addition to the trainer. Um, and what I would say is, it almost complements the trainer um, in regards to the camo. So the camo is that that typical ape camo. You know, in some garments you see like well there you go. I was just gonna say that you see the face. Uh, I think it's, I call it a face. Uh, it looks like an ape face to me, so it's going to be an ape face to me. Um, so you see the ape faces on it. Um, just a really nice camo. Now, this material, I want to say that it's a leather. But I don't think it is. I think it's like a, a pleather. So plastic kind of fake leather. Um, and you, I'm not sure if you can see that. Can you see my finger right through there? That's moving. So the whole point of them being ventilators is that they're a very a, 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 a very airy trainer. Um, so that mesh goes right through the trainer. A nice little touch, man. Um, so I'm holding them up to the air. And then you've got the detailing. Ape by a bathing ape. Thou shalt never kill ape. Blah, 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 blah. And then on the tongue, you've got Reebok ventilator. Yep, boom. Laces, just normal laces. You know it would be wassy with these if you put in leather flat laces. I'm gonna try and get a pair and show you guys. Um, and then you've got the, the lace holes, are black, um, kind of um, shiny, cool. Then you've got the sole, typical sole, but old, old type of people that know the OGs, the Hexalite system or the Hexalite gel system or whatever it is, mad thing. Then the piece de resistance, is the vents or the vent what well, I believe why they call it the ventilator um again these kind of I, th I thought they sat around I actually ordered these from America so I got these from um 
pack of shoes. Um, no, no import charges. There was no additional fees. I think I paid a hundred and ten US dollars, or maybe a hundred and. 20 i can't remember but that basically equivalates to well cheap um so i just wear these man i love them like man stopped me on the road when i wore these yesterday and said raw what are those and i thought he was taking the piss but he meant like those are heavy so i had to show him the eight and then i had to show him the two man them on the side with the guns and then show him that they were reebok and he was like raw those are bad i haven't seen them before but anyway i love them i love them i don't want to wear them too much but i'm gonna i'm gonna beat them to, to high heaven but if you haven't got them bummer because they are sold out now and they will increase in price gradually i think you can get them probably about 130 140 pounds if anyone wants a pair i could probably get you a pair for about 140 130 now there are people selling them on numerous forums and whatnot but anyhow rain the mask signing out see ya